Welcome to Motivational Life. In the ancient city of Athens, there lived a talented sculptor named Pygmalion. Pygmalion was known throughout the land for his exquisite statues, each one more beautiful than the last. Yet, for all his skill, he had a heart as cold and unyielding as the stone he worked with. One day, Pygmalion decided to sculpt a statue of a woman, more beautiful than any living being. He poured his heart and soul into his work, carving the marble with unmatched precision and passion. The statue, which he named Galatea, took on a breathtakingly lifelike appearance. But Pygmalion was still unsatisfied. He wished with all his heart that Galatea could truly come to life. The gods on Mount Olympus observed Pygmalion's longing, and decided to grant his fervent wish. Mercury, the messenger of the gods, descended to earth to visit Pygmalion. Disguised as a mortal, Mercury listened to Pygmalion's wish, and felt moved by the sculptor's deep love and devotion. He spoke to Pygmalion, saying, Your wish shall be granted. Tomorrow, when you return to your studio, you shall find that Galatea has come to life. Overwhelmed with joy, Pygmalion returned home, and eagerly awaited the morning. When he entered his studio the next day, he was astounded to find Galatea standing before him. Her eyes gleaming with life. Her lips curved into a gentle smile. Pygmalion's heart was filled with love for his creation. And they embraced as if they had known each other for a lifetime. Mercury, watching from above, smiled at the transformation he had brought about. He knew that Pygmalion had learned a valuable lesson about the power of love in the art of creation. The once cold, an unfeeling sculptor had been transformed into a warm, and compassionate man by the love he had poured into his work. The fable of Mercury and the sculptor teaches us that love and passion can bring even the coldest of hearts to life. It reminds us that the power of creation is not only in the skill of our hands, but also in the depth of our emotions and the love we invest in our work.